All right, I'm trying my last Marzen of 2022. This is Victory's Fest Beer, Marzen style lager. Welcome to Craft Beer Review. If you like talking beer, then be sure to subscribe and uh, leave me a message to let me know what you think. All right, I was very happy to find this one. This was my favorite uh, margin of 2021, and I struggled to find it this year. Uh, <laughs> I had to go to six stores before I uh, found it, uh, believe it or not, which is crazy, because last year I saw it everywhere. Uh, this year, nowhere. Um, but I eventually found it, and uh, let's take a look. All right. I've been looking forward to this one all year. Hopefully it's as good as I remember. This one really grew on me last fall. All right. That looks nice. Pretty clear, maybe a slight haze. Nice copper color, slight head. Some carbonation head in the top. Yeah, slight off-white head. All right, let's take a quick look at the bottle. All right, 5.6% alcohol by volume. This one is out of Downingtown, PA. Best by January of 2022. We are well in line with that. Let's see, a taste of Oktoberfest. Gather with friends, grab a boot of fest beer, and with a slap of the foam, let the festivities begin. Crafted with an authentic German recipe, this Marzen style lager is a perfect balance of subtly sweet and refreshingly smooth. Malt, Vienna, and Munich. And that right there, I think, is why I enjoy this Marzen so much. Hops, Tetnang and Hallertau, and then it just has the brewer's signature. I don't know if you can see that. Nice. All right. Yeah, that malt, that's what stands out to me, Vienna and Munich malt. The traditional grain bill for a Marzen was usually Pilsner malt and Munich malt. Uh, some breweries replace the Pilsner malt with Vienna malt, which is a slightly, I mean, it's not very dark, but it's a slightly darker malt. Um, but it has, it contributes much more toasted bready flavors to a beer than Pilsner malt. Um, and that's what I remember from this beer. I rem most Marsins have very, uh, you know, they have distinct flavors, but they're low in intensity. I remember this one having much stronger bready flavors. Um, so hopefully uh, my memory's accurate. Oh, yep, I'm smelling it right, right off the bat. Mm, getting some nice, you know, low intensity aroma, nice bready multi flavors, a little bit of herbal, hop character, which I love. Let's see, yep, according to the bottle, two varieties of hops, Tetnang and Hallertau. And I did pull up their website real quick. Didn't have much more information than on the bottle, but they do say those hops are whole flower hops. And they describe this beer as subtly sweet with a delicate malt nose. Our fest beer gains its impressive body from our use of all imported German malts and decoction brewing process. That looks nice. All right. Cheers. Oh, yeah. Mmm, that has a nice toasted bread finish. Oh, I'd say, mo like again, most Marzins have uh, bready flavors that are low in intensity. This one, the flavors are more uh, moderate in their intensity, a little bit stronger than your average uh, Marzen style Oktoberfest. 
and I and I so enjoy this one. Oh my god. Mm. Oh, that's nice. Does not have a whole lot of hot flavor in terms of herbal floral flavor, but there's a spiciness to it. Um uh, that I kind of get in the finish, and I think that's hop character. You could say it kind of either finishes with a little bit of hop bitterness or a little bit of hop spiciness. It's very interesting and very enjoyable. So this beer does have a little bit of hop character to it in the aroma and a little bit in the flavor. And I think it complements the nice bready flavors. Well, this is as good as I remember. I love this beer. I mean, literally love it. Like out of five stars, I would rate this at 4.75 stars. I really, really enjoy this Oktoberfest. I'm sitting here drinking this and I'm enjoying it more than the other margins I've had this year. I was just surprised that I struggled to find it this year. I mean, I live in New Jersey. We're not that far from Pennsylvania. I see Victory's beers everywhere. A lot of the stores that I go to have three or four different um, types of uh, beer from uh, Victory. Yet I couldn't find this anywhere. I literally didn't find it until I went to uh, the sixth store. And I kind of just went there on a whim. Um, it's not one I normally go to. So, uh, hey. I'm just happy I found it. Got a six pack and I'm gonna enjoy it. But if you see this one, highly recommend trying it. I love it. Cheers. 4.75 out of five stars.